Hi guys, it's Annie here. I just want to come on here and talk about how to overcome anxiety. Anxiety, I used to suffer so much anxiety to the point where I would get into panic attacks and still not know the answer of why I was so anxious. And looking back on it, like my younger self, I wish I had just sat with myself and got curious around, okay, what parts are showing up? You know, what are the feelings that are coming within? Whereas it got so much after my panic attack, I didn't even want to look at it. I didn't even want to acknowledge it. So I actually want every single person that's watching this to understand you're not alone, but also understanding why it's important to look at it after we have an anxiety attack or during the moment getting curious around self about what's showing up in our bodies and our mind and what is experiencing within the part of the anxiety. So what I want you to know, anxiety is felt when we're looking too far in the past. Often we look in the past and we dwell and then the anxiety arises, oh God, could have done this better, could have done that better. When we look too far in the future, we're actually creating anxiety because we're trying to keep control of the steering wheel. We're trying to keep so much control and tension that if this way doesn't go my way, everything is thrown out the like out the pram, basically. Everything has gone wrong. When actually we are not meant to take control, full control of outcomes. We're just here to show up and do our best. And that is the best that we can do, okay? So the only part where we don't feel anxiety is when we're in the present. When we're fully grounded, connected, courage, that part of self, we experience the world and the external world very differently. So let me go a bit more into that. You feel grounded, you feel connected, you feel courage, you feel confident. You feel all these sensations, you feel calm, you feel playful, you feel the authentic self that you are. That's what presence is. And when we come into the place of anxiety, that's where we wanna go straight away. We wanna go to a place where we don't put pressure on ourselves to get to that place of steadiness, presence, awareness, but we wanna get curious to eventually get there through the process, okay? Okay, I'm feeling really anxious because I'm thinking too far in the future. I need to go do a food shop. And I've got all these things I need to do today. Blah, 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 blah. I feel anxiety. The best thing I can do right now is actually sit down. Doesn't matter if I want to close my eyes. And actually take a few moments to breathe. <sighs> And set the intention to come back to self. Because you're better off doing it this way. Than still trying to high achieving parts of self. Trying to do the work. When actually when we're in a non self regulated state. That's causing us anxiety. We're never going to get to the place where we could be. And achieve more through the presence and the awareness of self. I hope this is making sense. We like to sometimes think about anxiety as something that isn't actually f with us, but something outside of us. The moment we can befriend this part of us that is either high achieving or inner critic parts that is causing these anxieties and hypertension, is the moment we can actually approach it with calmness and collectiveness and understand this is actually trying to protect me and this is my friend rather than my enemy, okay? So I actually really invite you to try it out. It doesn't matter if you get it wrong a thousand times. It matters that the process that you are doing and you are doing it consistently that's what matters because I promise you right now the moment you start doing this is the moment things start to change within your own internal world and the external will also meet that believe me so I hope this helps let me know 
if you have any feedback or you would like to know a little bit more detail on how to do this more specifically or how to do this in a more authentic way please reach out to me anything else please let me know thank you so much guys i hope you enjoyed and i can't wait to see you on the next video and i'm sending so much love to you all